Well, we're on the lookout for severe weather overnight tonight, so be sure to have a way to get alerts, watches and warnings when they are issued. 56 degrees, strong storms late, turning windy at times. We're looking at the potential for wind damage out of any of the storms. That's the primary threat, but there's also an isolated tornado threat here going into the overnight period. So once again, stay weather aware. Tomorrow, the storms get out of here early tomorrow morning. We'll have gusts up to 40 miles per hour through the afternoon. High temperatures only making their way slightly above 60 degrees, and then we're back in the warming trend again with high pressure on Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday breezy at times and then by the time we hit Friday we'll be on the lookout for another round of severe weather across the area with high temperatures in the middle 70s. Remember you can download our free mobile app WMAR2 News. It is available at the Apple and Google Play Store. It's great for a night like this to keep you weather aware for when those severe weather watches and warnings are issued. You can also look us up at WMAR2news.com, Facebook and Twitter for the latest weather updates. I'm meteorologist Eric Taylor. This WMAR2 News update is sponsored by Jones Junction.